and we have a COVID-19 antibody test. So I want everyone to see how these tests are done. And so you're not too worried about the test. For those who are really sick or you're really feeling bad symptoms, go get tested. For those of you who feel healthy, there really is no reason to get a test at the moment, simply because we there aren't that many tests out there. It's limited at the moment. The tests come in little packs like this, and there's different brands. Uh, you open it up, and Nick here has never been tested. So there are actually quite a few people who are apparently uh, immune because they've been exposed and didn't even realize it because they had such minor symptoms. And I, I, we, obviously we all hope that that's us. But uh, we will see today whether Nick has been exposed. So here it says COVID-19 test. You can see it's got a little plastic thing here. This is, it looks almost very similar to like a pregnancy test. There's gonna be a couple little marks on it. If you're positive, the, the, uh, there's IgM, IgG, and the C is control. You'll see a line in one of those. The control, you always see a, a faint line. If you get a positive, it's, it tends to be a pretty bright line. You put blood in that little square spot, with just a drop, and then you put the, uh, the, the buffer, or it's like a, a solution, it's a clear solution, drags the blood over the little test strip, and uh, that's how you, you see whether or not it's positive. So pick a finger. I, I would choose a finger that you're not gonna use it regularly, like use least, like maybe your pinky or something like that. Sure. Okay. So we just... Actually, can you do this one? Sure. So we just wipe it. So the best thing to do is you just squeeze it kind of tight so you don't feel it so much, and you pinch. And squeeze. See the blood coming out. Let me put what I have on there for now. Okay, okay, so this is the buffer. Pull off the end. You put two, two drops on it. One, two. And then a few moments, it'll start creeping up. Usually it appears pretty quickly. So IgM, nothing, no IgM line. So you're definitely not, uh, you don't have any early reactions. So IgM happens when you first get the, the COVID virus and your body starts to produce an immune response. After a while, the IgG kicks in and uh, those stick around, the IgM goes away. So it doesn't look like you have IgG either, but we're gonna keep waiting. You can see that little line that's forming right at the C. That's for control. That just tells you that the, the test is working. So Nick, I'm happy to say you do not have it. And unfortunately, you have not, you have not had it. And you do not have immunity yet either. <laughs> so I'll also post one uh, of a friend of ours who did have it. We knew she had it. We wanted to test the val to validate these tests to make sure they're actually working. So we did it on her, even though we knew she had already had it and she got over it. I'll show you that test too. It's very obvious what positive looks like.